Okay, and we are cruising right along. We're on step 10. And uh, step 10, disconnect the fuel line with the fuel rail using the appropriate wrench. Jack up the vehicle using the floor jack, support it with jack stands, remove the starter using the appropriate sockets. Disconnect the exhaust pipes from the manifold with the appropriate socket. Remove the flywheel housing cover, flywheel housing access cover using the appropriate socket. Benchmark the torque converter to the drive plate, then remove the bolts using the appropriate socket. Well, I got a little ahead of myself and started in on that uh, fuel rail prematurely. We didn't have the proper wrench to get that thing undone, but come up with a little idea there that worked pretty good, so we'll give you a quick quick peek at that. Okay. These things have got like little fingers inside them that you got to get spread open in order to get it up off there. What I got here is I took a took a little piece of hose right here and slid it. Wrapped it around there and, and, and slid it up inside there. Like that. And was able to push the fingers back out of the way and pop that dude right off there. Worked pretty good. Okay, onward and upward.